This is an open frame power supply, perhaps the most common type found in industrial applications, such as control panels and HMIs. We are going to be load testing this power supply in monitoring the PWM, or pulse width modulation, from this voltage regulator by looking at the output using the oscilloscope. This supply takes 110 volts AC on the input and provides 24 volts DC on the output. We have our leads hooked up to the multimeter to monitor the 24 volt output and these leads on our AC voltage input into ground reference for our oscilloscope. And these leads go to the load that we will be putting on the unit. And the IC pins are here on the back of the voltage regulator. We will turn on voltage and look at the PWM of this IC. This is a nice waveform. The width of each peak represents the time that the IC is on. And we expect to see it get larger with load increase because the circuit will need to increase to be on longer time periods to maintain the correct voltage. We will go ahead and increase the load to an amp. As you can see, the width at the top of the waveform increases to support the load. If we decrease the load, you can see the width get shorter. If too much load is applied or the circuit is overloaded, the waveform becomes irregular and the voltage begins to drop out. The power supply will not be able to provide an output voltage if this happens. This is why you should make sure your repaired power supplies get load tested. At Global Electronic Services, we believe in fully load testing all repairs to ensure you get a working and reliable unit.